Hey everyone, welcome to my very first um, trick training journey video with Anna. Um, I think you see her in the background walking along. Um, this is Anna, my borzoi. And after um, having so much uh, trick titles with my colleagues, I decided that I li like to have a trick title on Anna as well. Um, Anna is a borzoi. And they are not known to be very um, biddable. Um, they are very smart. They are super smart actually because she barks when her um, water bowl is empty. She barks when one of the collies drank from her water bowl. Um, she um, barks when there's someone on her bed and she always wins. So she's very smart. Um, Oliborzois tend to have... Um, uh, this habit of, um, is there any gain for me? No. Well, I'm not likely going to do things. So, training a borzoi is something different than training a collie. Um, I'm known for training my collies. I really love working with them. It's easy for me. I have had so many, many successes with training collies. I have never really have... Um, bad behavior with them. Of course, I have my struggles, but I can train through them. Anna. Um, and teaching a borzoi uh, skills and behaviors is a little bit more different, a little bit more difficult. And yeah, because Anna is now almost um, eight years, in March she will be eight years, I really like to... Um, encourage her to do more things, encourage her brain to be more active because it's very um, important to, um, to train the brain and to get them um, engaged in their brain. Um, so that is why I do this. Um, I made an Instagram especially for Anna um, to keep myself accountable because I know I set a goal and then I'm like Ah, it's not my day and then sometimes I stop so now I told you on YouTube and I told people on Facebook and we have an Instagram page so um, now I really need to get started with training Anna tricks and as you can see I'm in my new training area um, it sounds pretty cool but actually we just re build our garage so I have my nice indoor space to train in um, I know that when the weather is um, not always very great in the hall in Holland in the Netherlands we have a lot of rain and where I live there is loads of wind and I like to do cavaletti training and every time it's like nah, it's windy my cavaletti poles will fly away so I don't train and that's with a lot of stuff it's like, ah, oh, the weather is bad, I don't train. So now I have this beautiful space. It's not really big, but it's big enough for me. It's indoor. Um, I can set up like four to five cavaletti poles in here. So yeah, it's cool. I like it. It's not completely um, finished, but that's no problem. Um, yeah, and now I have to get started with training Anna. Um, I don't have an actual list on which tricks I want to train her. For a novice title I need 15 tricks. So just let's load up a clicker I think. Because hmm, Anna doesn't even know a clicker I think. Maybe. I need to reload the clicker. Um, get her aware. And then I will start off with some jumps. And hoof hoof. Oh, there's some stuff laying around here. Yeah. Mm. So we have to start with the clicker. I want to get her over some jumps. And then I want to train a sit. So let's see what happens.
foundation. Um, I started with using the clicker. Um, well, that went pretty okay. Then I did some sits and some jumps. And I was quite surprised. She did it pretty well. I know she likes these cookies. Um, you cannot fool a borzoi. Um, borzois love really nice treats. And I know that she likes her food. She likes her dinner. But she will not be working for her normal kibble. Not yet. Um, I will try to... Um, make her like to work for her kibble in the future but now I really need to get her interested in training um, so I used um, nice training treats I have um, from some companies and this may be a cool training tip but um, there are a lot of companies who sell mini packages of their uh, dog food and I use those small um, packages um, the, I, I now used something from Laxa Crunch. I don't know if I pronounced that, but it's um, a fish meal and it's really tiny and um, it comes in packages of 100 grams. And if you use that in training, they have a different flavor than your normal dog kibble. Um, and then when I progress in training I will mix in with my normal kibble that's munch it's an Italian breed it's also a very uh, nice type of food um, my colleagues um, actually only train, train on munch kibble uh, because they love it so much um, but yeah you cannot fool a borzoi they are smarter than you think and they outsmart you so I used a lot of really tasty tasty treats um, I hope you liked this very first YouTube video of Anna. Um, so, as I said, I need 15 tricks for her to be a novice trick dog. Um, sit and jump was not that bad. Um, but that is only two. So, if you want to follow along um, on Instagram, I will put all the info in the information box below this video. So, I hope you will... Um, Join my journey with Anna and I hope to get some nice comments. And if you have any questions, um, then you can send me a message on Instagram or Facebook or on um, below in the comment section below this video. So until next video and happy training.